Hey guys, Wells Knight here, and welcome back to another episode of Stardew Valley. And in today's episode, we're going to be doing some pretty cool stuff. I have some ideas, I have some things. I've been watching a couple of the videos from some other people, and uh, learned a few things about the game that I didn't know before. So, I think it's going to be good. I think it's going to be really good. I got some good tips. Um, but... I think the first thing we need to do, obviously, is do our daily chores, water our crops, all that kind of good stuff. So, let's get that done. I wish it was raining today. It does take a really long time to grow your crops. I'm thinking it might be better to kind of focus on less crops, but better ones. Like, the ones that take longer to grow, um, but, you know sell for a higher price uh just because i think uh that way we'd be uh we wouldn't have to do as much watering every morning because i mean look look at my energy bar i'm already down to like half my energy just from watering my crops at the start of the day like that's that's a pretty significant amount um and that's gonna make it kind of difficult to accomplish other stuff so now we can get like food and we can forage for stuff and things like that uh, which will make a difference but at the same time I mean that's a lot of energy we used over half of our energy just watering our crops now we have mail let's see tomorrow we're holding the egg festival in the town square you should arrive between 9 and 2 if you'd like to attend you don't want to miss the egg hunt well that's pretty cool uh, so let's look at a couple things first and foremost I want to take a look and see how much wood I have. I've got 90 pieces. That is not going to be nearly enough for what I want to do. Um, so we may have to go and gather some wood. I think before I do that, though, I'm going to have to go and find myself some food. We're going to have to forage. I'm going to look for some berries. Because uh, you can find bushes that look like this, but they have berries on them. Um, although I'm not sure if they spawn before the egg, like before, I'm not sure if there's a time or if it's just like in spring in general, you can find them. Uh, let's just kind of look around and see. Um, hmm. Not a whole lot of stuff here at the moment. Let's see. Oh, there's a dandelion. We might as well grab that. We can always sell it. And I also want to run up to the town center and see what we've got for like foraging bundles and stuff like that uh, we'll see what we can find let's see here very lacking in the berries department though that's for sure man okay so I, my Skype is going crazy I the professionalism is real I totally forgot to turn off my Skype um, okay let's head into here and we'll just see Okay, so I think this is the one that has the uh, the spring crops bundle, and we need parsnips, green beans, cauliflower, and potatoes. Okay, so let's see here what we can find, and then this one's fishing, but I don't have any of that kind of stuff right now. So we'll want to set aside each of those crops, and I'm definitely going to want to get cauliflower and green beans growing uh, ASAP, because we've got a limited amount of time left in spring where they can actually grow. So, let's see here. Oh, and there's a quest on here. Monsters known as slime. Enter the mines and slay six slimes for 240 gold. That's actually pretty doable. Maybe we'll do that. Uh, but I want beans. We'll actually grab a couple of these because they're not bad. And then I need a cauliflower seed. And I think I've already got parsnips and potatoes growing. But just in case, I'll grab a few more. So, that's pretty good. Um, let's go ahead... Ooh. Let's go ahead and... Go into the mines and see if maybe we can kill a couple slimes for that quest. That's probably a good plan. Let's see here. Uh, mine should be up this way, if I remember correctly. Uh, my stamina is pretty low, though, so we may not actually be able to get down far enough where we can actually get any slimes we'll have to see we'll have to see and i don't think i have any food on me either do i nope just seeds and stuff all right well that's all right let's head into the mines and see what we can do uh let's see so we will go down oh do i not have the elevator i thought i no i'm, I'm almost positive i've been to level five. Oh, level 10 yeah there we go 
cool. So, we should be able to find some slimes down here. There's one. Oh, and I'm stuck. Ow! Hey, quit it! Oh, these things are bad. Those bee things are, like, super annoying. And loud. They're also very loud. I may want to get a better sword, but if I, I, I've i actually been playing uh, Stardew a little bit on my own time, like not recording it. I have a separate save file. Um, look at all these guys. They're everywhere. And I know that if I get to level 20 in the mines, I'll get a better sword. So I might hold off until that. Stop attacking me. There we go. Um, and I need the copper... But, at the same time, I'm also very limited on energy right now. So, uh, let's actually grab one of these torches just to carry it around with us so we can see where we're going. There's another slime. Oh! Get the sword! Get the... Get... Ow! Stop it! I can't grab my sword. There we go. Okay. So, that's two slimes down. Got a couple more to go. And I suppose we could also kind of head over this way. No, we've already been down there. Okay. Well, let's just kind of hope that we can find... There we go. Found the way down. All right. We got to get the slimes. We need six of them. This will be three. There we go. And kill the bug. And a little bit of wood. Always good. We're going to need 300 wood. Oh, actually, I think this is going to be all the slimes we actually need. There we go. Get him. Get him. There we go. Okay. So that should be all the slimes. Now we just need to talk to the wizard. We'll just finish clearing out this, uh, this area. And then once that's done, um, I'll head and talk to the wizard and we'll, we'll claim our 240 gold. Those guys are really annoying too, but they're not too hard to kill once you know they're there. You can just kind of trigger them, step off. For Ooh, there's another one. See what I mean? They're not super hard to get rid of. They're just kind of annoying. There we go. Two cherry bombs. Always a good reward. And I could go down further, but I don't think I'm going to. I think I'm going to call it right here as far as the mining goes. Uh, just because we need to be able to get back to the surface. Um, I will probably grab a little bit of this copper, though, if I can actually get it. There we go. Three copper ore. And another one. Okay, not too bad. Leave the mine. All right, let's get out of here. And we will head off to see the wizard. So I'm going to go over to the wizard's place, guys, and I will meet you there in just a little bit. All right, guys, before we head off to see the wizard, I'm thinking... It would probably be wise to plant our additional crops here, if I can... Why you no ho? There we go. It was being difficult. Uh, so let's just go ahead and plant our beans first, I think. And they come with this little... Oh, I misplaced that one. Oh, well. It's fine. There we go. And then we also have some parsnips and some potatoes. And I think I'll just plant those, like, over here, and it'll be fine. Let's water those up real quick. Definitely want to upgrade my watering can in the near future as well. That's kind of a priority for me, just because um, it takes so long to water crops. Uh, but we're going to head off to see the wizard. Where is my scythe? There it is. I just need to clear a little bit of a path here. And... We might have to break a couple things. That's okay. There we go. Alright, so this should pretty much take us to the wizard if we head off in this direction-ish. Kind of, sort of. Somewhere over here. I think this will work. Let's see. Over here is the wizard down, right? He's like right here? Yeah, there we go. Awesome. So we'll be able to claim this quest and get a bit of a reward. I also sold all of the uh, the stuff that I foraged. There we go. And we'll take our 240 gold. Yay, money. Okay. 
So, we got that going for us. Now we need to get our hands on some wood. Um, and that's basically what I'm going to do until I'm pretty much out of energy. So, let's see here. I think we'll just kind of chop down a couple of these stumps. And I think we have just enough energy to chop down, like, one tree. Or maybe we can chop this one down. Yeah, let's do this. Down you go. And then we need to clear the the log as well. There. Alright, so that got us a little bit of wood. But I need, like, 300 wood, which is a massive, massive amount. So, yeah... It's going to be a little while before I have the wood that I need, but that's okay. It'll be well worth it in the end. But guys, I think I am pretty much out of time for this episode. So, if you enjoyed this video, don't forget to like, subscribe, and leave me a comment. I do appreciate it, and it really helps out my channel. You can also find me on Facebook, Twitter, and Twitch. There are links in the video description below, so check that out as well. Otherwise, guys, thanks for watching, and I'll definitely see you next time.